Welcome back. We are here with part two of our sixth generation royal family and we are still at war so we are going to continue that today. So let's get started. As we know we will have Noel and Lucille leave for war. If you are not caught up you should get caught up but <laughs> I'll explain it anyway. So Gabriel did die in the last part so Noel has to go and um, over here in the Kitsune Dechi we have no one left but Elsie, who is currently pregnant, so she can't go, but uh, she was originally from the Griffin family, so Noel is going to have Lucille, who used to be a Griffin, represent Elsie in the war. So that is what is happening here. My dog is crying because he's a crybaby. Um, how do I math here? One more, okay. Wars are expensive. Okay, so poor Rhonda. Oh, she did have the baby. Well, well, she was pregnant the last time I checked. So anyway, she's not going because there are three babies in this household. <laughs> she had triplets. And from the Siren family, we already have Lori. From the Griffin family, since Evan died in the last one, we will be taking... Mikhail, who just got married to Celeste to give her kind of control over the duchy while he is at war and in case he dies. So that is why she um, she was with Evan, but they weren't married, so she didn't have legitimacy until just now. And here we go. He's coming too. And I will take some of your money. Wow, we're actually running really low on money, so maybe I'll just take... Yeah. Okay. And I think that's it because Marcelo is still alive as well. So let's head to Newcrest. Here we have our six Sims and we are going to find out whether the war will end today and who will survive. If Noelle dies, we have a problem <laughs> because she's our current queen. So she will be going head to head with King Max from Newcrest, who just killed her father in the last part. So that's a big deal. And uh, we have Mikhail who just joined, Lucille who just joined, but Lori and Marcella were already there. So I will just catch you guys when this finishes loading. Okay, we are here at the battlefield. Lucille is in a bathing suit. Okay, that's fine. It's totally cool. Okay. Shermy? <laughs> Sorry. They're cute when they... I think the elders are really cute when they, like, yeah, grab their backs. <laughs> okay, so actually, let's let's work our way down. We'll save Max for last and Noel for second to last. If Max does die, we end the war. So Lucille, who's been forced to come here... I left my headline effects on. Okay, so we are going to start with Lucille. Now, elders have a 50% chance of dying. So Lucille and Lori both have a 50% chance of dying. She needs to, on a two, we're rolling out of two, and she needs to not get a two. So, Lucille, come over here, please. Will you just, and will you change your clothes? <laughs> I mean, it's not that you don't look good in the bathing suit, but you could, you know. Is that the same dress I put Rhonda in? <laughs> anyway, um, okay. Lucille, will you be killed by Max here today? Come here. And she will. She will. <laughs> oh. Lucille. Oh, Lucille. Um, I guess we don't have to figure out what to do with you after all because we are all done with you. Goodbye, Lucille. Goodbye. Good riddance. I mean, we don't want people on our side to die, but is that her daughter over there? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, <gasps> Hey, Celeste, I'm not, like, killing your mother over there or anything. Oh, 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 oh. oh 
man. Okay. Um, yes. So actually I think he is pretty close with the Grim Reaper. No, not anymore. Does the, no, I'm not going to plead for her. I want her to die. Um, I could have sworn that he knew the Grim Reaper because he knew all the Grim Reaper's traits. I'm surprised that went away. Anyway. Hey, Grim. Okay, so Lucille is down. I'm, I'm not really that upset about it. Like, I needed to figure out what to do with her anyway, but at the same time, you know, what can you do? I guess she was demoted back to Lady, and she lost her royal title. So, sucks to suck. Okay, let's um, get another picture, I guess. I need something for the thumbnail. And oh, look at him. He just puts his hands on his hips like, yep, I did that. Okay, Lori is next. Actually, Lori is the last member of the fifth generation left alive. Poor Lori. She's been fighting really hard. So I was actually wrong. Lori was not here from the beginning. The only one who has been here from the beginning is Max and Marcello. Lori came on the second battle. Her husband died in the first. So that's what happened there. Will you be killed by Max today? She needs to also not roll a two because she's an elder. And ooh, we are also losing Lori today. This is This is not a good day for us, you guys. I mean, okay, it's sort of a good day. We're okay with Lucille dying. Um, okay, well, that's that's everybody from Gen 5 is now dead. So there's that. Are you making fun of the Grim Reaper? <laughs> Dude, I know you're confident, but still. Okay, so ooh, we are not doing good. We're going to we're going to run out of Sims. We are going to run out of Sims. And then what? <laughs> Do we lose? What happens to all of our babies if all the adults die? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I guess Nora will have to take care of them all because she's in the, Nora is a member of the Newcrest kingdom, but she's in love with Jared Siren. So it's a little Romeo and Juliet thing there, but um, yeah. Oh my gosh. I don't know what we're going to do, you guys. <laughs> what if all our Sims die? <laughs> I'm starting to get worried now that this has gone on for quite some time, you know? Duchess, Lori, Siren, Gen 5. Okay, well, there you go. Oh, boy. Who's calling you? Your dead father. Mm -hmm. Seriously, the aliens always come over here to talk to us. Okay, uh, next we're going to go with... Mikhail here, who's in his pajamas, and who just got married. Like, just got married. Come over here. Can we please not lose anybody else today? Let's get... Look at all these graveyards. <laughs> or not graveyards. You, you know what I mean. Uh, gravestones. Okay, so Mikhail. And he needs... He's a young adult, so he needs to not roll a three out of three. So he is, oh, he's going to live. Okay, go back over there. Run away. Just get away from the situation. <laughs> Marcelo. Okay, so Marcelo, are you scaring? Seriously? What are you doing? Grim. Grim. What are you doing? You guys are like best buddies now. What the heck? He didn't like that. Oh, maybe he did like that. I don't know. Anyway, Marcelo. Okay, so Marcelo basically, I'm going to explain that right now, Marcelo's wife is having an affair with his brother back home. <laughs> so uh, they're both kind of worried about him coming back and what that'll mean for their family. But, you know, you win some, you lose some. So let's do this. He needs to also not roll a three. He rolled a three. He rolled a three, you guys. Okay. Um, okay. Well, I guess they don't have to worry about that now. How come everything's getting wrapped up by this? <laughs> All of my plot lines are getting wrapped up by the fact that everybody involved is dying. Okay. Um, 
So he'd ended up dying. Wow. Okay. We're losing a lot of Sims today. <laughs> I'm nervous. I'm really nervous. Um, okay. He was here from the beginning. He was... Okay, so Max is so far the only one left that has been here from the beginning. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Duke, Marcelo, Perry, Chen, Gen 6. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Noel. Noel, Noel, Noel. Oh no. This is scary, you guys. What? I don't want her to die. <laughs> I love her. This is not a barrier gaze kind of let's play. <laughs> um, okay. Okay. Noel. Maybe, like, let's talk to him for a second. Maybe, let's argue about politics. So, basically, oh, yeah, be mad at each other, you two. Okay, so they're arguing. They do not like each other, obviously. He killed her father and a lot of people in her um, kingdom. And, you know, her father killed his son. So it's all it's all eye for an eye at this point. But anyway, so they're going to argue and they're going to talk about, like, is there anything we can do to stop this? You know, is there anything we can do? And maybe Max says, you know what, there is. And he, because, you know, I mean, he's kind of winning. <laughs> We've lost a lot more Sims than they have. Um, so he says, you know what, there is. Absolutely. We could combine our kingdoms. But you guys have to agree to, uh, you know, that we would both do our customs. So it would then have to be a patriarchy but they could have purple eyes so the firstborn son with purple eyes would be the king and so in you know combining their kingdoms that would mean that you know I mean he doesn't have any kids anymore so he doesn't even have an heir right now so he would need a wife and so maybe he says to Noel like we could get married and have a son with purple eyes heir. That's the deal. You know, combine everything about the kingdoms, including the monarchs. And, I mean, first off, Noelle is a lesbian, so she's not really into that in the first place. But, you know, I feel like she would do it if, if she, like, really felt like her kingdom was in serious danger. But she's been training really, really hard for this war. She's been practicing. She's been getting ready. She is not afraid. So I think that she like has a lot of confidence in herself. Yeah, look at her. Very confident. She's very confident. And so she's like laughing at him. She's like, yeah, right. Like I would ever agree to that. So she's like, no way are we going to combine our kingdoms. That's not going to happen. My kingdom will be winning this war. You can go you know, look at her, like, hand up, you can go and suck it, like, forget you, shout forbidden words, <laughs> so they are going to not be able to come to some kind of agreement or some kind of alliance or, what's the word, where you, you both agree to stop fighting, <laughs> I forget, <laughs> anyway, yeah, no, we're not apologizing, okay, so they are going to not come to a conclusion she's going to reject his proposal and um so we're gonna roll on noel okay so she needs to not roll a three who's calling you no celeste <laughs> okay so she rejects his offer and she says you know what kill me <laughs> so they are going to roll on Noel, and she needs to not get a three, so she just needs a one or a two, and I need you to live because I love you, so. 
yes, okay, okay. Noelle will be surviving this encounter. The question is, will Max survive this encounter? So if Max rolls a one or two, it's the same deal. He will live and the war will continue on and the war will not end today. So we need him to roll a three. We really need that for us. He has to be. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. I got this. <laughs> okay. So he needs to roll a three in order for this all to be over right now and for us to win. Maybe if like if we keep going, I think that we'll, you know, if everybody dies, we'll re need to reconsider his, his offer. <laughs> but um, for right now, Noelle is still alive. She's very energized. She's feeling good. So let's do this. He needs to roll a three in order for this all to be over. And he rolled a three, you guys. He rolled a three. Oh my gosh, he rolled a three. Okay, okay, okay. This is great. <laughs> this is great. This is great. This is great. Okay. Okay. We, we won. Hold on, hold on. Let's kill him. <laughs> We won. We won the war. This is good because I really didn't know what we were going to do if this kept going. <laughs> okay. Whew. We did it, you guys. We did it. Uh, how should we kill him? Oh, let's light him on fire. Absolutely. <laughs> yes. Okay. We did it. Oh, Noelle, I'm so proud of you. I'm so proud of you. There's the Grim Reaper behind you. Let's get some, like, cool... Yeah, she's feeling good. Ah, grim. Okay, this is great, you guys. What, you're surprised now? <laughs> okay, we won the war, you guys. We won, we won, we won. I'm so happy. Oh my gosh, I was, I was really concerned that we were going to actually run out of Sims. And statistically, like, it's wild that he survived this long because... There was only two of them, and so many of ours have died. It's just, it's wild. So, anyway. Let's get him going, and then we will head to the graveyard. Whoosh. Okay. Excellent. I don't need his grave, though. So we're going to leave that here for now. Let's head over to the graveyard. Do, do, do. We'll put our sims down. We'll give Noelle and Mikhail some scars. And then we'll send them home. That'll be great. Everyone can go home. Okay, here we are. Let's put these down. Actually, you know what else I want to do? Um, I want them to have lost all the money to the war. I feel like that's only fair. Wars are expensive. Oh, that was loud. Okay. Alrighty. Let's put these down. Which one is this? Tell me. Marcelo, he's over here. And he's actually on the big one because he was the Duke. And since he already has a child, Axel will not be inheriting any titles. Because um, the daughter and is inheriting the title right now. Okay, Lucille, you can come up here. I'll accept it. Where's the... Okay. Just throw this over here. Do, do, do. Come on, back it up. Come on. Come on. What are you doing? How come I can't push that back? There we go. Down you go. Good riddance, Lucille. I am going to let her be there. I mean, she died at war, and 
she was queen for a while, and I don't know. I'm just going to leave her there. I don't know where else to put her. Siren, siren. Where is the siren household? Is it this one? Yeah. Oh, Lori. Yep. There we go. Okay. Now let's let's go back to manage worlds and we'll do the create a sim there and we'll do the moving them back into their houses. Okie doke. Let's do this. So they both need scars. Oh, I forgot to do I forgot to do full edit, didn't I? Please let me add something. Oh, I can. Oh, good, good, good. What should we put on her? Maybe a cheek scar, like a little. But I want it to be more noticeable than that. That's too much. That's too much. <laughs> Maybe something like on her eye. Yeah, maybe something like that. Yeah. Oh, hold on, let me... She has two of these. Let's get a new picture of you for the family tree. Oh, okay. Smile, cheese, cheese. Can you stop looking away from me, though? <laughs> Thank you. Okay, well, you know that one of those is going to have to be good enough. <laughs> okay, you. You, too. Um, how about a mouth scar right there? Should I give him some facial hair? Maybe he like grows out his beard in order to um, hide it a little bit. Oh God, that's so ugly. No, 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 no. Oh, it looks bad. It looks bad. That's better. Okay. Cheese. Good enough. Okay. Wait, he's evil? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay, Whew. let's move them back home and call it good. Uh, oh, I'm so happy that the war is over. I'm so happy that Noelle won. And I'm happy that we didn't have to eventually have her marry Max because he's gross. But that was an option. Not for like a long-term plan, but like a maybe until we killed him plan, you know? Okay. Let's move them back home. Do, 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 do. Yeah, this save file is really struggling, like a lot. Maybe I should like start a new save and just move all my households into that save. Then would it not be as, maybe then it wouldn't be as bad. I don't know. I don't feel like doing that right now. Okay. Willow Creek. Actually, here's the Griffin household. You go in there. And then we will put Noelle back home as well. Whoops, I didn't mean to click that. Don't. don't. <laughs> no, I didn't mean to click that. <laughs> okay. Okay, okie dokie doke. Okay. So we have won the war. We are going to get Noelle to go home to Rhonda. Mikhail gets to go home as well. They, they are the only two who have survived war. I'm going to put their new scarred pictures up instead of their fresh-faced young adult I'm happy and nothing bad has ever happened to me yet faces. <laughs> um, okay, Noelle. So that's the plan. I hope that you guys liked this whole war storyline. Um, it was really fun for me. I really did want to try it out, and I wanted there to be some kind of greater conflict besides conflict just in our kingdom. So that was really fun for me. Oh, and we can Nora is going to be able to um, get together with Jared finally. I'm sad that neither of his kids ended up purple, though. Got to admit, I was disappointed by that. Alrighty, three babies, huh? All right, time to go home to your wife. Yay. Oh, I'm so happy. This is great. This is great. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed, and that is where we will wrap up our war, and I will catch you in the next one for, you know, what happens next with them.